Good morning. Um, it's about seven o'clock here today. Um, it's surgery day. I'm having my left foot done for my bunion. And to be at the surgical center in 45 minutes. I have no makeup, just some um, lip gloss, which I'll have to, not lip gloss, but like lip balm, which I'll have to take out since they put a tube in my throat but I have a loose shirt which they recommended and I have my I have my Bermuda shorts because they tell you to bring some loose shorts to keep on and then I have my Birkenstocks but yeah that's what they recommended and then brought my Birkenstocks because they're about the same height as this surgical shoe because I don't want to walk funny after I get back into normal shoes because that did take me like three days to get used to walking normally again because it was just such an uneven um, level I guess because the surgical shoe has like a platform on it and I mostly wear just flats. So I did have to get used to that. But here's one more shot of my foot, which I'm having surgery on. Let me see if I can get it. Okay. So this, this will be gone soon. You can tell it's ready like red it's always red because the shoes are always hitting it even when I'm not wearing shoes it's always red so yeah um I guess I'll see you guys after my surgery and tell you how I went this time so I'll see you soon hi everyone um done with my surgery it's 10 o'clock right now I'm still a little like sleepy from the anesthesia, but I made my husband come over here to Brooklyn Water Bagel so I can get something to eat because I was starving this morning. But apparently they had a cancellation. Someone canceled their surgery this morning. So once I got there, they like took me straight into surgery. But yeah, everything's great. I'm over here in the back seat because I have to have my foot elevated and I have an ice pack on so here's my foot let me see here's my ice pack got my boot on yeah everything's good I'm I'm starting to get feeling and well my toes are fine my my big toe and the toe that's next to it are still numb from the from the numbing um, medicine they put in it for surgery but yeah it was easy well I think the most painful part was them trying to find a vein on my arm <laughs> yeah so I got stuck in like the left arm on the side of my wrist and then I have a band-aid here because she stuck me again on the other arm still couldn't find it then she found another nurse and he found it in like three seconds because my veins are kind of like hidden so he found one it was like deep down there but yeah I'm doing fine I'm gonna go home I'm pretty tired I was like extremely tired this morning from waking up early but yeah everything's good I think I have like I wouldn't say a headache just like pressure from waking up from the anesthesia I have a little bit of that like weird metallic -y taste in my mouth from like when they pulled out the tube um, but so far no nausea which is great I'll be able to eat my food quickly <laughs> and yeah I'm gonna enjoy my iced coffee and my bagel sandwich and I'll see you later. This is gonna be, I might put this up t 
tomorrow, maybe. Just so you can get like day of and then the day after results from my surgery. So yeah, I'll see you soon. Bye. Hi everyone, this is the day after my surgery for my left bunion. And yeah, so far so good. I didn't have any pain yesterday, but you know, you also have your toes numb for pretty much the whole day after surgery. Um, but today the numbing has worn off and I still have no pain, which I'm really happy about. <clears throat> because I was hoping everything would go well like the first time when I did my right foot and it seems like it's gonna be the same thing so that's really great I'm just sitting here um, watching Hulu I'm about to watch Blacklist and I guess multitasking because I'm also gonna start playing my Sims 4 and yeah that's pretty much what I do all day since yesterday um, but yeah, I'm here icing my foot. I have to ice it every 20 minutes each hour. So let me switch you over. See if I can get my foot. Here it is. Just icing it. I got this little ice pack from Amazon. My same you know, foot pillow because I need to have it elevated at least for the first week. It's here in bandages still. Still have like that liquid stuff they put on your foot during surgery. Still bandaged up. Looks pretty good. <clears throat> but like I said, still no pain. Um, I guess this is gonna be a pretty short video. I have a clip from yesterday and a clip from today. My follow-up for post-surgery is on Tuesday so I'll keep you updated then on Tuesday I think is when they take off the bandages <clears throat> and then reapply them and I'll be able to walk around with just one crutch to just help keep some of the weight off of that foot but right now I am on crutches which I hate so much and I have to pee like all the time because you have to drink lots of fluids throughout the day just so you can help with the healing process and yeah that's what I've been up to um yeah regular videos will be back up um, maybe after March 10th on the 9th no March 8th we're gonna go drive to Savannah, that's about a four hour drive, and then four hours north from there, just north of Georgia, and we're going to pick up our puppy and bring her home, so I'm excited, I'm going to take, um, I'm going to videotape some of that, so you guys can meet my new baby girl, and yeah, we should be back home Sunday, probably be the next video. So next week a video of my follow-up and then the week after that a video of my puppy and bringing her home and then after that it'll be like normal makeup, Disney videos, food videos. So yeah, I'll see you then. <clears throat> see you then and remember to subscribe and hit that like button and yeah until next time. Bye!